My glasses are crooked. Hello, everybody. Hello, everyone. Hello. Should we say hello to everybody? I guess I have to go all the way up to the top. Yeah. Hi, yeah, Sugar. Yeah. Mom. Go ahead, Jeff. You can do it this time. Uh, Panda loves YouTube. Thrifty Esme. Sugar Plum Fairy. Hello, everyone. Carla. Jeff brought some amazing hard goods, you guys. I did. Okay, six, seven. All right, we have six in here so far. I'm going to share it out again. Let's see if we can get a few more people. And um, Loves has a question. Okay. I got to get back in the chat. Okay. <laughs> Did I get the Disney leggings? They are on their way. I have a few pairs of TC2 Disney leggings around here somewhere. Uh, yes, I have uh, three pairs of TC2s currently. And probably a couple pairs of uh, TCs. So I could bring those tonight. We have seven people in here so far. I'm sharing it out. Yes, Carla. Well, I'm sure there'll be plenty of deals. <laughs> I've got books, hard goods. Lots of things. Hi, Deborah. Carla wants to know what Disney prints did you get? Um, I have tonight. I think I have 10 to 20 pair coming in still. But tonight in the TC2s, I've got Goofy. I've got Alice in Wonderland. And then I've got the uh, vintage look Mickey ones. That's in the TC2s. And then I've got the Dumbo Circus print, they call it, in the TC1. And... I 
have the Daisy Ducks. And I have a vintage Mickey print, 3D Mickey, they call it. Another 3D Mickey. And that is it in the Disney prints, I think. Okay. I also got a kind of exciting one. A rare paisley bird print they are called in the TCs. Thanks, Miranda. All right, you ready to go, Jeff? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna put you up and right. then, so I can grab something to eat. I'll help, I'll get you typed first and then I will, um, oops, wrong button. And then I will um, get you to eat. Oh, what is it doing? Silly computer. Oh, there it goes. All right, All right. And first up tonight, I've got the Art of Choking, medieval engravings from Japan created in the ancient Choken, gilded with gold and silver, 24 karat gold trim in its box. I do not believe I have a stand. It says it originally came with a stand, but the box. And here is the plate. Starting bid of $3. Okay. The images are created by etching pure copper and then gilding it with silver and gold. The engravings were originally created to decorate the armament of the samurai warriors. The art form was handed down for over 800 years. 24 karat gold edge made in Japan. Back. Yeah, I can bring them tonight. I hadn't intended on it, but if there's people in the chat that are looking for them, I can bring them. And it is six inches, and then the inner circle is three inches.
any interest. Gotta pass from Carla, so we'll go ahead and pass it in ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We'll go ahead and pass it. All right, I've got a rooster starting at two dollars. It's for in your gardens. You push this down into the soil. It's made to look like wood, but it's that um, plastic resin type of material. And that pushes down into the ground. Shipping? Yes. Uh, it's not that heavy. Uh, it weighs in at a pound. A little over. So it's not going to be that expensive to ship it. Uh, and Misha Mene, we do a lot of back shipping. And Misha's in it at two. Okay. We can go ahead and call it then. All righty. No other so we're going once. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Misha Renee. For two dollars and ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and we are sold 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 congratulations Misha wants you to explain the shipping again okay I'm gonna type it in there okay thank you go ahead and do another one while I do this okay that would be awesome thank you. All right, starting at a dollar, I've got spice can. It says pepper on it.
Golden Clipper brand. So oh, I'm going to need to write this in, don't I? New York. Container made in England. Is it like a salt and pepper shaker or just a tin? Um, it's a tin, but when you press the top, it pops up. And what's your start again? Sorry. One dollar. All right, guys, we're looking for a one dollar bet on this or a pass. Yeah, it could be refilled to be used. Uh, let me turn my microphone up a little. Is it too loud or not loud enough? It might be the fan tonight, Jeff. I can hear it clicking. Fan's not on. Oh, isn't it? No, I hear it clicking, though, too. Okay, when I go mute, does it go away? Yeah, it went away. So it's me. Yep, now it clicked again. Evening, Frugalicity. Do we have any interest or a pass? Thanks, Nisha. Thanks, Nisha. Can you hear it now? No. Okay. I changed my mic settings. Yep. Now it's back. Yeah. And we're going to pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and we're past. Okay. Yeah. All right. Do you want me to go up enough, or do you want to keep yeah. showing? No, go ahead. Okay. Of course, I'm not ready. You know that today. All right, um, 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 it was not ready for me, so scramble. Um, we need any more. Let me grab these because I know we should in here. So let's just get this out of the way. I'm going to start these at five. Um, that's called, here's a hug. They're size medium and they're vintage overalls. Mesa Renee comes in at five. Do we have anyone in for six?
All right, go ahead and start calling it to Misha Renee for five. All right. Going once. Going twice. Last call in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are sold to Misha Renee. Congratulations. Congratulations, Misha. All right. Put this up here. No. All right. I'm just going to grab these down here. We're going to do the wrestling figurines. Just two of them for now. And we're going to start these at five. We get two of them for five dollars. They are jointed. Um, let me see the phone here. I saw my magnifying glass the other day. Thank you. Um, I do not see a year of them. I could be wrong. It should be on the bottom foot. Okay. You're right, Jeff. Uh, this one is 2010. So you get two of them at $5. This guy here. And then this one. Yes, I believe one was Dusty Rhodes. This one is... Hey, Pages. Jeff has books tonight, Pages. This is 2003. So you get both of them for $5. So that's two dollars and fifty cents a piece, guys. So it's a really good deal. All right, we're going to pass this in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are pass, pass, pass. All right, Jeff, you ready? Yep. I've got TC2 Mickey Mouse leggings. TC2 starting bid of $12. They go anywhere from 15 the whole way up through $40 a pair. These are the TC2s, the Mickey. They are new. There are the TC2 LuLaRoe.
Any interest, guys? All right, we'll go ahead and pass them for now. Choice of tins at a dollar starting bid. There's three to choose from. One says moon cake. One says they all say mooncake on them. Real Housewife comes in at a dollar. Any other interest? If not, we can start to call it. All righty. Going once. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be pulled in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two one and we are sold the angie for one dollar congratulations congratulations you want one two or three all three perfect and that's under real real housewife yep or angie jeff yep. Um, Angie, I will share it with him after we're done with the um, live today. Yes. All right. Let's try this. This is made in China and painted by Shanghai. It's a painted egg. And as far as I can tell, when I take it out, it is a real egg that has been pan painted. It feels like it. When you tap it, it sounds like it. It's got the hollow hole where they blew the yolk out. Starting and at $5. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm.
Yes, very pretty. Here's the box. I know, I was even a little worried about the shipping on it. <laughs> but I would make sure I packed it carefully. And it does have on the bottom the art number 38358E. It is very pretty. Any interest or pass, guys? Hi, Dawn. Vexing Rose's path. Carla says pass. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. We're going to go ahead and pass it. Jeff, go ahead and show another. Okay. Starting bid $2. Over and Over by Charlotte Zaltau, book, pictures by Garth Williams, dated 1957. A little bit of wear on the spine right here. And the pictures are beautiful in this book. Angie comes in at $2. Tell us a story. Once there was a little girl who didn't understand about time. She was so little that she didn't know about Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. She certainly didn't know about January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, or December. She was so little, she didn't even know summer, winter, autumn, and spring. What she did know about was all mixed together. She remembered a snowman and a pumpkin and a Christmas tree and a birthday cake and a Thanksgiving dinner and a Valentine. But they were all mixed up in her mind. And on the back it says, it's the Harper Crest Library Edition.
I'm gonna go ahead and start calling it. All righty. And we're going once to Angie. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold and we intend nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right, Jeff. All right. I will put me up. I have no idea what to show. I am prepared. All right, let's just go this. One, two, three. Right, let's grab that one. Four, four, five, six. Um, seven. Eight and nine and ten. Okay, so we're going to start a resell box of clothing. So, we have 10 items in a box for a dollar. And I'll show you this one. And if anybody else wants any, um, just let me know after the bidding is done. So, this will be in a re and we're going to start at $10. So this is Coldwater Creek, size X large. It is like a um, shawl. It has very pretty um, weaving down all the way around it with some lace. And this one doesn't have a tag. It's a black and white knee length dress. Um, this one is O'Neill, size 36 short, men's shorts. Um, we have a denim skirt, size 14, maxi length. These are Gloria Vanderbilt, size 10 jeans. There's another pair of jeans by Zena. It's also size 10. Oops, and I bumped us. How about that, Jeff? Okay. Right there. All right. Um, this is a Patrick Christopher size medium blazer. So you get 10 pieces of clothing. For ten dollars. Here's a little skirt and it's basic edition size extra large. Here is another um, indigo size one X. It is a button down shirt. It is pink in color and it has the stripes inside. And then I have a cold water creek size 16 um, jacket. There might be one more piece. Let me look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, well, that's 10. Maybe it comes in at 10. Okay. Going once, okay. going twice, last call, in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are sold. Congratulations, Misha. Um, Misha, I can do more of these if you are interested. 
at ten dollars a box or if anybody else is i can do many more guys i am trying to reduce the load so i'm just going to start doing it this way until everything is gone so if you want more than one box i can make mystery boxes with this kind of idea in mind and i can do men's women's children all right do you want just one Gina? Gina, you can have one for ten dollars. Do yep. you want men's, boys, girls, or mix? <laughs> or mix? Or mix. Yep. Gina says a mystery women's, please. Okay. Okay. Does anybody else want any more? Trust me, I have plenty of clothes if we did five or six people. <laughs> she likes vintage. Okay, I'll see what I can find for you. Um, yeah, I can substitute for the jeans. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. Here, just let me make a note so I know. I have probably close to, what, 700 pieces of clothing, guys? So it doesn't bother me. <laughs> I just need to get rid of all this. Okay. Wheels and Dales, yes. We have lots of wrestling figures we can bring back. Yes. Uh-huh. I do. Okay. Uh, so take the jeans out. This lot. Pages wants to know if you can do a men's medium sized t shirts exclusively. I'd have to check on that one. Um, I went through the other day and sorted everybody, but let, let me make you a note and I will email you pages. It may take a few days because I'm still behind on some shipping. So today didn't go as well. So, okay, no problem, Misha. I will put this in here. Okay. Um, you want me to show another thing? Yeah, go for it. All right. So men's t-shirts, size, medium for pages. Yeah. I wasn't able to get out to the garage today. Um, it was 40 to 50 mile an hour winds this afternoon, and I was just not even going to play. Okay. I'm going to grab this. This is a calendar. If anybody has looked this up, it's a very good brand. It is 1978 by J.R. Tolkien calendar. And I'm going to start this at four. I'm going to be very careful flipping through this, but, but I can show you the pictures. J.R. Token is the one that does the Lord of the Rings, guys. On eBay, these guys guys run about twenty to forty dollars for this calendar. Yep, they do, Beck. You guys are getting my eBay pile now, but everything's got to go. Hi, Julie. Okay, this is a full size one. Oops, and I got them upside down. Yep. Yep, you guys are into the eBay pile. You think this is good? You should see some of the other boxes I put together the other day. All right, do you want to call us to Julie for four? 
Not a problem, Julie. You just seem to pop in at a good time. Going once. Going twice. Last call. Ten, nine, eight. Pages comes in at five. Okay. No problem, Pages. Julie comes back in at six. So in 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're sold to Julie for $6. Congratulations. Thank you, Julie. All right, Jeff, you ready? Yep. Okay. Choice starting at a dollar. Um, actually, hold on. Yes, it did. Okay, so starting at a dollar, you'll get it's a two piece. I have no idea what it says. Wow, is it like on? Is it metal? Um, this is a cardboard type box and then it's got the metal tin on the inside. And I think when you open it up, it says panty flawless skin. It's beauty of beauty and a beauty is a must. And it smells like it was some type of lotion. But it's just got really beautiful. Okay, Angie's in at one. That's what it says there. I'm assume I can't read the rest, so. But even here it says 1932 on the lid. If I can get that to focus. It doesn't want to focus. How long they've been in business. Yes, I'd say the bottom is more modern because it has the UPC. Yeah, frugalicity. When it gets closer, it's hard. It doesn't want to focus. All right, we'll go ahead and call it. All righty. So we're going once to Angie. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Angie. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. All right. Next up, starting at...
two dollars i've got a double picture frame it opens up to sit on like a desk the back has that velvet feel to it And it is glass on the inside. And it would hold a five by seven. Any interest? If not, we'll go ahead and pass it. In 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're going to go ahead and pass it. All right, next up, I want to sell these as a set. Starting at $3, it is an Oriental husband and wife, and they are bells on the inside. Well, the wife is. The man's bell, there it goes. And they have little pillows that they sit on. Misha Renee comes in at three. Yes, they are neat. I'll show this one first. All right, Misha's in at three. Yeah. They're cute. They are. She has a lot more detail to her with the signs and symbols on her. And then the two little pillows, purple and red. And there is a sticker on the bottom of the pillow. See if I can get it there.
All right, you want me to start calling this? Permission? That works. Okay. All right, so we're going once to Misha. And going twice. Last call. And we're going to be sold to Misha in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right, you're up. I know, I got to figure out what I'm going to grab. Okay. I wasn't very organized today, guys. Let's see here. Let's, oh, we need the wrestling, don't we? Yes, they were asking for more wrestling. Let me grab this, guys, and then we'll do wrestling next. So we're going to do a choice of coin banks, Jeff, starting at a dollar. Okay. Hold on. Oh. Okay. So you get a choice. The winner, high bidder, will get a choice which one they want. We have this one as a jukebox. It's a coin sorter. Um, this one here is a wagon. Um, this one is a piano. I think we have two pianos. And then we have this one here. Um, this one's a coin sorter and a thing to hold your pencils in it. Um, we have another wagon. And then we have this one here, which is a different piano, but another piano. Loves comes in at one. Moms, you'd have to come in at two. in it too. Love comes in at three, Beck comes back in at four. Loves is in at five. Carla is out. Okay. Beck is out. All right. So Loves is in at five. Okay. Do you, do you want to start calling it Jeff for five? Going once. Going twice. Last call in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are sold. Congratulations. Which one would you like? <laughs> you have that one here. We have two of these. We have two of those. We have one of those. Oh, I'm playing, trying to play Tetris here, Jeff. Oh, my gosh. And we have this one here. Oh, my gosh. And then we have 
This one here. She would like a jukebox. Can I have a jukebox? Okay, yes. This is a jukebox. So I'll put your name on that one. Where did I put the stickies? Uh oh. Okay, I dropped the stickies. Okay, does anybody else want one for five? Pages would like a jute box for five dollars. Okay. Mom's up or Beck would like a wagon. Carla, which one would you like? Okay, Pages wants the jute box. I think I only have one jute box, guys, don't I? I have this one's a piano. I have two piano. I only have one jute box. Pages. Um Beck uh, wants pages, pages was just respelling it because Loves had it spelled wrong. Oh, okay. Okay. So next after Loves would be Beck would like a wagon. Okay. Okay. Carla would like a piano. Okay. Okay, so let's take back once a wagon. Okay, got a wagon out, and I have a piano out. Okay, and I have this one up. Does anybody else want any? <laughs> no problem, Beth. Okay. All right. What is left? I have um, two more pianos. I have these two here. And then I have this one's upside down. This one here, the coin sorter bank, and then another wagon. Carla, I gave you this piano because it was this one here. That's the one I gave you, Carla. So you know. Anybody else want any? All right. Okay, if anybody else comes in, just say at the bottom, and um, I will put your name on one of them. Keep moving. Okay, I got rid of this one. All right, we're going to go back to wrestling figures. Let's try a couple different options. So we're going to do choice. Carlos? Uh, what do you, uh, one, I... One of each. Oh, does she want this piano too? Do you want that piano too, Carla? Is that the Two way pianos. I'm understanding it? Yes, yes. Two pianos. Okay, that's fine. All right, let me put it down. Times two. Okay, we're going to do choice of wrestling figures. So two of them for $5 start. Um, should we mix it up? Oh, that's what I have. That one has some damage. Hold on, guys. Okay. We're going to do these two guys. Gold dust. Yes. How did you know that, Jeff? Good guess. <laughs> you know you're wrestling. <laughs> Okay, or you can choose this one. We're starting them at five dollars. That's two fifty a piece, or the highest this bidder can choose. They want both. Gold dust should be the nineties on his foot. Okay, I can look. Oh wait, gold dust has issues. Hold on, gold dust has issues. He was chewed on. 
We gotta replace him. Hold on, guys. I'm not gonna. So I got these. I picked them up. That one needs to be cleaned. Here we, we go. Got wheels and deals in at five. Okay, so I'm gonna switch it up. Unless you guys want the gold dust, but his arm was chewed up by dog. So I have these two. And then I have these two. No worries, pages. I only have what four more bags in the garage, Jeff. Yes, the great Pally, that was one of them. <laughs> yes, Beck. You're funny. All right. So we're going to say going once. Okay. Going twice. Last call. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are sold to Wheels and Deals. For five dollars, he would like both sets. Okay. All right. I'm gonna check, make sure we have your info when Jeff is up here. I think we do, but I want to just double check. Okay. Okay. All right. Next up, I have a new cane wall scroll from 1987 with the calendar. Here's the box. Now, what I want to show you, starting at $3, they have taped it. I'm not going to remove that tape. They have taped it here and over here to hide the calendar so that it is just the picture of the swan. If you were to remove that tape, I'm pretty sure it would fold down just fine to show the calendar again. On the back, it says made in Taiwan, exclusively for the Macquarie Corporation. So if anyone remembers Macquarie's. York, Pennsylvania. And if you look at the side here, you can see the calendar is in there. It is intact, but it was taped up so that it would hide it so that they could just display the picture. Hey, Joe. Sherry says pass. So in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're going to go ahead and pass it.
Yes, everyone hit that thumbs up button. Next up is a miniature teapot. The lid comes off. It does have the spout that is open. Starting at $3. I see no chips, cracks, crazing. The sticker has been worn off from being cleaned, it looks like. We can start it at two. All right, guys, we're looking for a $2 bid for this or a pass. Oh, I'm losing stickers. All right, guys. Pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are passed. Jeff, go ahead and show another thing. Made in Taiwan. It's your vintage planter. ROC starting at three dollars. There is one issue right here that you can see there is like a crack. It does not go all the way through, but it has started to. I think from a plant being in it. And it's your train with the duck and the elephant and another duck on the other side. Blues and pinks, probably for a mother when they were in the hospital having a baby to take them flowers.
in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're going to go ahead and pass it. Starting at a dollar, beekeeping for profit and pleasure. 19. 44. 1944. Dust jacket does have a little bit of damage, but the book itself is in good condition for 44. One of the 18 full-page illustrations from Beekeeping for Profit and Pleasure. It covers the family and its units, the modern hive, the locations of the hives, how to obtain bees, how to install a hive, ways and work of the bees, tools and equipment needed, bee stings, management in the spring, winter, fall, honey and its taste, diseases, the queen and the worker, and honey plants. All right, uh, Andy's in at two. Carla's in at four. <sighs> Panda, I can grab from my piles of clothes. Um, I have mostly hard goods tonight, but I can bring clothes if people are interested. Sorry, Jeff. It's okay. <laughs> Lucas walked in dripping wet. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I don't know what he was doing, but he was shivering. We can go ahead and start calling it to Carla. Okay. So we're going once to Carla. Going twice. Panda wants to know if you have any clothes tonight, Jeff. I already, yep, I already answered that. I said I do have clothes. If I know what people are looking for, I can go grab from the piles. Okay, sorry, I didn't see that. That's okay. All right, and we're going to be sold in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right. You're up, April. Okay. All right. Let's see. I just grabbed them from a pile over there, guys. I have no idea what I have. All right. So this is... What is this? Okay, hold on. All right, for having one of those days. All right, is that the top, the bottom? Nope, that's the bottom. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is called SI Style, and it is a size medium, and it is a jumpsuit, and we're going to start it at two. So it's a one piece, long sleeve. With embellishments, it is brown. And it is a one piece jumpsuit. What was your thought? Uh, two dollars. Misha no. Renee comes in at two. Okay. And it is made of 100% cotton. And it does have, I think, pockets right here, maybe. Just like small little pockets. 
one's a little bit bigger. All right, do you want to start calling this to Misha Renee for two dollars? Sure. Going once, going twice, last call in ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We are sold. Congratulations, Misha. Thank you, Misha. All right, let's grab this shirt here. Was we'll started at a dollar. It is faded glory, and it's a size two X, which is a size twenty. It is a red short sleeve, paisley design shirt. It does have the scoop neck. So you can see it is a faded glory. Uh, material, not a problem. 100% cotton, Carla. What was your start? I'm sorry. That's okay. One dollar. And what size was that? Uh, size 2X. I can't climb on chairs, Sherry. So you're going to have to go this way. So it goes right about there in me. And yes, I'm wearing my Lulu reg leggings again. It's all I wear. Now the problem I have, guys, which pair do I wear? I only have 14 pairs. Sherry says too short. Okay, not a problem. All right, we're going to pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Carla comes in at 1. Okay. Go ahead and call it to Carla for 1 then. All right. Going once. Going twice in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We are sold to Carla for $1. Thank you very much. I don't want to send a no chairs tonight. I had a very long walk today. Okay, I've got a set of four books starting at $5. So I've got nursing assistant, nursing aid exam preparation, nursing school entrance exams, paramedic certification exam, and becoming a healthcare professional. $8, $10, $15, and $10 were the original prices on them. Okay, and so you're doing a lot of books? A lot of books, yes. And what is your start, Jeff? Starting at $5. Okay. Are they written in? No, they are not written in. Okay. I know that's the question. The practice exam bubble sheets. You can go online and fill in a code and it will show you. Um, 
Here's a question. One of them is a client with left sided weakness should be taught to A, B, C, or D. Um, is there a year? Uh, this one is 2012. This one is 2009. This is the fourth edition, 2009 and 2010. 2009 through 2012, it looks like. Okay. That comes in at five. And actually, that's, I guess, at the school what they sold them for, because on the back, just the price on two of these is, uh, all three of these, all four of these is $20, 1995 so. We can go ahead and call it. Okay. All right. So we're going once, two, back for five. And we are going twice. Last call. And we're going to be sold oh, back. Barry comes in at six. Okay. And I'll read the titles again. It's your nursing school entrance exams. I believe that was the 2012 one. Nursing assistant nurses aid exam plus an added value of access to online practice with instant scoring on all of them. Your paramedic certification exam and becoming a healthcare professional by Learning Express. Back comes in at seven. Jerry is out, so we can go ahead and call it to Beck. Okay. So we're going once. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Beck in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two, one, and we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right, was that your two, Jeff, or you got one more? I got one more here. Okay. All right. Let's do, and actually, Beck, I'm going to throw another one in there. Healthcare Essentials, a glossary and study guide. So I'm going to throw that in with yours for free. All right. Get a Jump on Life, the student answer book, and five steps to real estate success. Two books starting at $2. 
fifteen dollars and sixteen ninety five on them. One has a lot about education planning, financial aid, how to discover, online practice tests for the ACT, SAT, PSATs, um, discover secrets of the free ride program, scholarships. And then the other one is business and real estate. A writer who specializes in educational and reference works. Her 12 years of experience include eight years of editorial staff. Um, Panda would like to know if you have any 2XL graphics tees. I will check when you come up next. Okay. I, I know I have two XLs. I'm just not sure what the graphics are on them, but I will pull them in. Okay. All right, guys, we're looking for a $2 um, bid on this or a pass. All right, we're going to go ahead and pass them. Okay. Do you want to show another thing, Jeff, since you had a pass? Um, sure. First person with a dollar gets it. It's in his... Dr. Larry Crabb, Real Changes is Possible if You're Willing to Start from the Inside Out book. That gets it. Okay. All right. The Skilled Helper. Same way, model skills and methods for affecting helping. The second edition, first dollar. <laughs> You're funny Act back. Exploration, goal setting in life. Attending to listening, all sorts of. Any interest in that one? Beck comes in for a dollar for that one, too. Sold. Okay. All right. You're up, April. All right. All right. Then I can type these in if you need to go run. Okay. It's going to take me probably about five minutes, so. That's fine. I can, I'll hold the fort till we get, you get back. Perfect. No, I know. No, I have to go grab two XLTs. All right. So this is Faded Glory. It is a size 14 and they are shorts. And we're going to start this at a dollar, guys.
All right, guys, we're looking for a $1 bid or a pass. They are striped, kind of like, um, they are kind of like blue striped shorts. <laughs> awesome, Carla. I think I lost another five pounds after today's walk. We'll see what happens tomorrow when I get on the scale. Yeah, engineer shorts, kind of like that, but they are they are women's. All right, guys, if there's no interest, we're... All right, guys, if there's no interest, we're going to pass this in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we're going to pass it, guys. All right, so the next thing that I have is CG, oh, I can talk, CJ Banks. It's a size 1X new. Yeah, up, yeah, uphill both ways. Yeah, I know. I want to roll down on the way back, but would have been kind of dangerous. There's a lot of rocks. Um, 1X is brand new with tags, and we're going to start this at five. And it is a maxi skirt length. Yes. And it is a checkered pattern. And it is brand new tags, guys. $55. Guys, they're funny in the chat tonight. Yeah, and I can tell you what material it's made of, maybe. Uh, I'm going to say it's polyester, guys. I cannot find. Oh, here it is. See if I'm right. Nope, I was wrong. It's 100% rayon. All right, guys. We're looking for a $5 bid on this brand new maxi skirt by CJ Banks. It's a size 1X. It has a $55 price tag on it. <laughs> nope, it's a skirt, Carla. All right, and we're going to pass this, guys, in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are passed. Not a problem, guys. I'll put it on eBay. All right. So this is a pair of Levi jeans, and they are size um. Wait, wait, wait. My tag thirty-two thirty. I think is what I looked at. Oh, I gotta type this in there, don't I? I'm gonna put these at two. Jeans. Oops. Size. 32, 30, start, it's going to be $2, all right, I'm assuming that they are men's jeans, I don't think they're women's, but I, yeah, they're women, men's jeans, they do have some fading back here, but that would be the only fading that I do see. The bottoms are not that bad. 
All right, Beck is in it too. Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought too. Yep. All right, so I've Beck in it too. Does anybody want to go to three? All right, so we have uh, back in it two. Does anybody want to go to three? All right, so we're going once to back. And we are going twice. And last call, and we're going to be sold to Beck in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations, Beck. Jeff, are you ready? Sure. Okay, I'm going to put you up, and then I'm going to go grab a couple more pieces of clothing. Okay. Next up, I have starting at... Three dollars. The pants, power practice, powerful practice to score high and pass the physician assistant national certifying exam. Thirty dollars and thirty nine dollars on the back. Still in the plastic, never opened. And what is your start, Jeff? Three dollars. Okay. Preparing for a brighter future. Success is necessary and mandatory for becoming a physician assistant. Pants power practice features full length tests provide the concentrated practice you need to earn that top score. An indispensable part of your pants study plan. You'll find access to three exams, two in the book, one online that are based on the official test along with detailed explanation answers. Sherry, I couldn't tell you without opening it what year it is. I'm going to guess it's in that 2000 range though. It does not tell me. And that's in the test prep medical field, it says. Yeah, there's no year on it without opening it up. You want the ISBN? Nine seven eight dash one dash five seven six eight five dash eight nine seven dash four. Here I'll type it. Uh, nine seven eight dash one dash five seven six eight five dash eight nine seven dash four. Sherry comes in at two. Love you. Love you too. Oh. Okay, I'll keep it for a while. All right, Sherry's in at two. Mm -hmm.
I think Carla's looking it up. I'm not sure. Okay. And be able to. Two thousand twelve. That's the year on it, Jeff? Yes. Okay. That's what Carla said. I didn't get a chance to get into it yet, but Okay. Do you want me to call this a sherry for two? That's fine with me. All right, so we're going once. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Sherry in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes, Carla, I got you. All right. New with tags, men's 2X, 2XL large, and it is the Giants and the Texas 2010 Fall Classic, and it has the label on it. The 2010 World Series, starting at $4. Okay. And it does say genuine merchandise. It's a shirt, a graphic shirt from 2010. The 2010 World Series between the Giants and Texas. I can open it too. That's not a problem. Nothing on the back, and that's the front. Still has the tag on it. August of 2010. All right, guys, we're looking for a $4 bid on this. Hey, Jeff, can you hold up a one so I can see where we're at, Mike? Mm -hmm. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five. Six, we're about under six, seven seconds. So that's not bad. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. All right, guys, we're looking for $4 or pass. Panda says a pass with a heart. Okay. We'll go ahead and pass it. I'll throw it on eBay. Okay, no worries. Not a problem. Go ahead and grab another thing, Jeff, since you had a pass. All right. Two XL Fruit of the Loom. It is Watu Wear Motor in Air Conditioning Torso Vacancy from nineteen ninety five. Double stitch. Started at four dollars.
Panda comes in at four. On the sleeve, it does have, I don't know, a little crazy guy. <laughs> 2XL. All right, we can go ahead and start calling it. All righty, so we're going once to Panda. And we are going twice to Panda. And last uh, call. If Panda still wants it for $2, I can do that. I just noticed there is a small hole in the sleeve. Okay. I see that, okay. That's the only spot. It's got a little small hole in the sleeve there. So if she wants it for two, she can have it. If not, that's fine. She says she wants it, so. All right. Hey. Okay. All right, so we're sold to Panda for two. Right, Jeff, my turn. Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. I got clothing. We're just gonna go with it today. All right. This is Nike Golf. It's a size extra large. It is from our local Boise Open. It is kind of like a wind bake, red windbreaker jacket, and we're gonna start it at three dollars. So you are aware it does have what they call an Albertson open right here. And it is short sleeve. So you are aware it does have Hershey's on this arm. And it does have uh, two zippered pockets. And it does have a zipper here that is about three quarters of the length down. Julie comes in at $3. Okay. And is that embroidered or is that like a... Um, it looks embroidered, but I can't... It, it, yep, it's embroidered. Okay. All right, does anybody want to go to four? Carla says air vents. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. All right, start calling this to Julie for three. Going once. Oh, I almost did it again. Going I gotta stop writing on my computer. <laughs> Last call. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We are sold to Julie for three dollars. Congratulations. Okay. In the box. Okay. Um, let's grab this. This is called a Bonnie Lee um, conversion of Leroy. And it is a, um, oh, it's like a sweater. 
It's kind of like a sweater jacket. I'm going to start it at three. And it is cream color. What was your start? Three dollars? Yes. I do not have a size though. It's the only thing I had don't have. Let's see. I want to say it's either a large or extra large. Nope. For me, it's tight, guys, and I'm in an extra large. So I would say either medium or large. What's it made of, April? Um, that is a good question. It's not wool, guys. It is kind of like a knitted fabric. So almost like a yarn feeling. But it does not have any anything anywhere. So I, I don't know for sure. This is all I have, guys, for a tag, and it's half off. <laughs> and if there's no interest, guys, just type pass. Not a problem. Awesome, loves. I know. All right, two passes, not a problem, guys. All right. Do you want me to show one more real quick, Jeff? Go for it. Okay. All right. Since I got behind in putting swimsuits up, you guys are going to get a bonus. Um, this is called Cup She, and we're going to start. This is brand new with tags. It's a size extra large, and we're going to start this at $4. It is a one-piece bathing suit. It has the green on the bottom and then it turns to the lines at the top. And it's brand new with tags. Um, yes, this is the It's a extra large. And if there's no interest, guys, no worries. I'll just throw this on eBay. No worries, Carla. All right, guys, we're going to pass this in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are passed. All right, Jeff, you ready? Yep. Okay. All right, this one I am going to start at $4. I'll show you why. It is Dave... Dravicky comeback, one of the most dramatic moments in sports history by the New York Times. But it also comes with two tickets that were to the premiere showing that were used for that. It is a dramatic story of baseball, ba bravery, faith, and one of the greatest comebacks of all time. With the ticket subs, I guess they made a movie about it too. I'm not positive on that.
All right, guys, we're looking for a $4 bid or a pass. We got two passes. We'll go ahead and pass it. Not a problem. All righty. 2XL graphic T for the Dallas Mavericks. And on the back, it says, I party with the Mavs. There's the front. 2XL. back and what is your start three dollars and it is a gildan 100 percent cotton All right, guys, we're looking for a $3 bid or a pass. All right, we'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. Throw it on eBay. Panda says, pass, sorry, my dad's not a sports fan. It's all right. Start $3. Game over, Andrew for ants. It says that on the front, on the back, game over for ants. 2XO, made by Delta. Yes, it does. All right, Carla's in at three. All right. All right, so Carla's in at three. Does anybody want to go to four? I just wanted to admit, this, that was for this one, right, Carla? I'm pretty sure it was, but the way it yeah. falls on the chat, I wasn't sure. <laughs> okay, go ahead and call it. All righty, so we're going once to Carla. Hi, Kim. And we are going twice. Oops, and I can't spell today. And last call. And we are going to be sold to Carla in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations, Carla.
Orange Panda, 2XL, started at $3. It's an energy drink shirt. Two XL. Robust energy drink. Okay, Panda's in at three. She goes, orange works, LOL. That works. It's kind of like a burn orange. It's actually a nice color. It is, I agree. And the graphics on there are really cool. Yeah, they are. Go ahead and call it. All right, so we're going once the panda. No worries, Carla. Uh, going twice. Last call, oops. And we're gonna be sold the panda in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two one and we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations, Panda. Congratulations. All right. She said, "My dad says thanks." No problem. All yeah, right. The other one I have is the Missouri Tigers, and I don't think he's a sports fan. You said so. Yeah. I think you're up. Okay. All right, let's grab this dress. We're gonna start this at three. It's an AGB dress, size 12. It is a sleeveless dress. And I would say it falls on me just below the knees. And I can tell you what it's made of, maybe. It's made of 97% polyester and 3% uh, spandex. It's a very cool design. Uh, Jeff, Carla would like to know what size the tires was. 2XL. Yeah, you can have it for three. I can do that. All right, guys, we're looking for a $3 bid on this dress or pass. All right, we're going to pass this, guys, in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are passed. Sorry, Jeff. We're thinking alike again. That's okay. <laughs> All right. Let's try this one. It's Kathy Daniels, size small. Um, 
These seem to be plastic, but it's really cute. It is a jacket, and we're going to start it at two. <laughs> Sorry, I tried to lower it. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Size small jacket, right? Um, size, um, uh, size eight. Oh, size eight. Okay. Yeah. And your start was uh, two dollars. Okay. okay, I'll lower my voice. <laughs> there are no stains or holes. Hey, April, I'm going to go out and come back in. Okay. And see if that helps with sound. Okay. Um, are the sleeves three quarter? Um, yes, just about. They go right to the me. Like five minutes or so. Let's see what he's doing. I don't know why Jeff is like frozen over here. Here, I'll, I'll kick him out. He's like frozen. Okay, me. Hold on. No, I don't want to do that. Hold on. All right. Oh, that's better. Okay. Now I got to put me back up. Whoa. They're saying it looks like a kid's jacket. Um, it's got a woman's name on it. It goes, it goes on me. Now I'm echoing. So it goes right here on me. So it is short. Okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to get the girl this clothes, Carla. That's all. All right, we're going to pass it. Do you want me to grab another thing? Yep, go for it. Let's put the last on the floor. All right. Um, this is Corrid City Blues Petite, and it's a size small. And it is a uh, full length wrap. We're going to just start this at a dollar, guys. I've brought this once before. I just need it. I need to get rid of things. No problem, guys. Not a problem. Not a problem. I have so many clothes, guys. I just want them gone. <laughs> Is that denim or cotton? Ninety percent cotton and ten percent polyester. Okay. And it does have the Fourth of July theme on it. Okay, Jeff is in for a dollar. All right.
Carla, Sherry's right. Both of them, Jeff and Sherry, both tell me, no more buying. I'm grounded. Yeah, and I am till this week. All right, so we're going once to Jeff. And we are going twice. And last call. And we are going to be sold to Jeff in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations, Jeff. Carla, I'd say up to two weeks, yes. Okay. <laughs> You're right, it won't fit me, but I can have it altered to fit my niece or a cousin. So, yeah. all right, Jeff. All right, I have a hand painted Nini teapot collection starting at five dollars. This is like a trinket box, then. Here's the lid to the box. And here is a little teapot. Lid comes off. And you've got your little trinket holder. All right, Julie's in at five. does come with its original box. And it is stamped on the bottom then Nini, N-I-N-I. -N -I. Are they all different? It's just one teapot, correct? It's just one. And it's actually a trinket holder, not a teapot. Oh, is it? I'm sorry. Yeah, no problem. I mean, it looks like a teapot, but it's actually just a little trinket holder thing. Oopsie. It looks like a teapot. It does look <laughs> like a teapot, but there's no hole inside. Okay. It does say hand painted on the bottom. And it does have a chain attached to the lid so that you don't lose the lid or accidentally drop it off the table. That's true, you could hide a key to your china hutch in there. Handcrafted in China. They call it a English Imari teapot. All right, we have Julian at five. Does anybody want to go to six? Show the other side now. The other side is exactly.
All right, do you want me to call it to duty for five? Um, yeah. Frugalicity, so I'll be no. six. Uh, no, because I already have a bid in on this, so I can't start adding stuff. Okay. If he wants to buy the plate for a dollar, I'm willing to do that. We'll go ahead and call it. All right, so we're going once to Julie. And we are going twice. Last call. Yes, for Glicity, I will take one dollar for the plate. All right, and we're gonna be sold to Julie in ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and we are sold to Julie for five. Congratulations. And then Frugalicity is going to take the plate. Okay. For a dollar. Per yep. Put that in that thing so we can see it. Mm -hmm. I put it in the chat so you know. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. All right. Next plate starts at two dollars. There is no markings on it. It does have the holes in the back so that it could be hung on a wall. And it's signed M S R I M A R A. There's the name at the bottom there, right here. Julie comes in at two. All right. Call it. All righty. So we're going once to Julie. And we are going twice. Last call. And we're going to be sold to Julie in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Um... I don't know the character's name. I think I did. But Jeff's going to have to help me where I put them. Um, that, the great Kahali was the big dig. <laughs> was it this? Oh, this one's broke. Wasn't that one, was it, Jeff? I can't see you. You still have me up. I know. It's your turn. That one? No. That's, um, I'm pretty sure you did sell it. 
Okay. I mean, I have more. Okay, thank you, Panda. <laughs> I do have two more I can bring up after my turn, guys. Okay, go ahead, Jeff, if you want. Sorry. Oh, okay. Misty Mornings and Moonless Nights by Strung McMillan. Started at a dollar. It is... Nineteen seventy four by Norman Strum. There we go. And it actually has what's called a table fair in the back of the book, which gives you recipes for duck, um, waterfowl table, apple sausage, roasted duck, boiled duck, sauteed duck. The back is all about, or the inside is all about the boats, the blinds. It's a water fowler's guide. Yep, it's a duck book. All about hunting them, cooking them, the boats, the blinds, all that. Go ahead and pass it. Alrighty. You got one more, Jeff? Um, set of three starting at $3, The Daily Guidepost from 1987, Daily Guidepost from 2010, and Daily Guidepost from 2009. Okay. All right, guys, we're looking for a $3 start on these books, on these Daily Guy post books. In 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We'll go ahead and pass them. All right. Do you want me to put me up, Jeff? Yep, go for it. Okay. Fix my screen. All right, I'll bring two more. I have no clue what they are. They are marked 2003, and it's a $5 start.
All right, guys, we're looking for a $5 start on these or a pass. Thank you, Pacers. Okay, Pedro says they're Bobby Lashley in the Miz. It's one of those things where April says, I'll list these on eBay. Yep, I will. Never gets done. All right. All right, guys, we're going to pass this in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we are passed. My computer, what are you doing? Stop tonight. All right, let's try this. This is apartment nine, the size extra large. It is a jacket and I'm gonna start it at four and I can give you what the contact of it is. My keyboard's not working right now, Jeff. I don't know what I did to it. Okay. I did something to it. I'll figure it out. Oh, that is sad. It is black. And I can tell you what it's native, hopefully. Yeah, it's plugged in. It just, I bumped something and now it won't let me type it. My keyboard doesn't work. I'll figure it out. I'm not worried. Um, it says imitation water on it. So it's imitation mother. There is nothing that I can see that is wrong with it. Okay. Oh, it's a laptop, Carla. Maybe, oh, maybe that's me too. <laughs> nope. I, I broke it, Jeff. Okay, do you want us to call this the panda for four? Going once. Like the site. Going once. There we go. All right, we're sold to Panda for four dollars. Congratulations! Thank you very much, Panda. All right, Up here with the rest of them before they fall over. Um, let me see. Let's grab this, and I have to go grab more. All right, this is a RK size eight, and it is a 
a long dress, sleeveless, and we're gonna start it at a dollar. You said long sleeve dress? Um, it's No, it's a long uh, dress, uh, sleeveless. Okay. Sorry. Start was what? Uh, $1. Ugh. There we go. Thank you. It is very pretty, Mom. It does have the drawstring uh, <coughs> on the back. Oh, what did I do to my computer, Jeff? You might have to restart. <sighs> oh, if I would have known that, Julie. Um... Julie's looking for men's sweaters. Size? Yeah, I was just going to say size. Now who pulls Spiegel's looking? All right, we're going to pass it. I'm going to put you up so I can play with my computer. All right. <laughs> All right. First up. Uh... I've I'm gonna restart. I'll be right back. It plays the song There Is Love, the wedding song by American Music Box. Here's the cover. I'll open it in a minute, but I can't let it play long. Obviously, you guys know why. Sides. And when you open it, Wind-ups on the bottom. Yeah, it's wood. Hey, Jeff, I'm going to restart my computer. So you're going to be stuck on the screen for just a second. Okay. Four little brass looking legs on the bottom. What's the design on the top? It looks like it's a wedding veil, a wedding ring, the wet, the bouquet of flowers, some white gloves, a lace tablecloth. Trying to get it without a glare. There. Just opens there, pink velvet insides. Look 
We're going to go ahead and pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. We're going to go ahead and pass it. All right, next up, I have a figurine. We're going to start it. Five dollars. It's got a wood base, and the fabric is kind of. Oh, sorry, guys. The fan does come out. Carla Shore, I can do three dollars on it. The head feels like it's not China. It's kind of like a it almost sounds like a resin. Bottom. Jeff, did you see Carlos comment? Yep. Okay. Yes, I got the keyboard fixed, guys. I don't know what I did. <laughs> All right, guys, we're looking for a $5 bid on this Asian doll. If five is too much, go ahead and start it at three. Okay. Vexing Rose, big men's sweaters, I will check on. I may have some yet. What size are you looking for, Vexing Rose? She said big men's. Okay. Like 2X, 3X, 4X, 5X. She is very pretty, Carla. I don't know. This is the box she came in, but I don't know. Well, I think it is the original box because the writing on it Oh, yeah. Is that. And this is inside it. Just packing to help keep her safe and secure. But they, even the original twines on the box that would have like tied it shut. It's really cool. I can get a height for you if I can find my tape measure. I just had it. Got it. She stands nine inches tall. And from the base bottom, it's five inches. She's about three. My mom said she looks hand painted. She does look hand painted to me too. I'll try and get a close up, but yeah, she does. And I, right. I I forget what that's called when they put stuff in the fabric, but the fabric's like stiff to the touch, so that it kind of hangs right, you know. All right, Julie's in at three. All right.
That might be it, Carla. I'm not sure. All right. Do you want me to call us to Julie for three? Yep, that works for me. All right. So we're going once to Julie. And we are going twice. And last call. And we are going to be sold to Julie in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations, Julie. Congratulations. All right, was that your second, Jeff? Yes, it was. Okay. Well, I don't have anything ready. Hold on one second, guys. I gotta go to my more clothes. Unless we want some hard goods here. We're doing good with clothes. Let's grab these two. I'm sitting right here. We've gotta go anyways. Okay. It's not what I thought was in here, but I'm gonna bring it anyways. I wonder where that one is. Okay. This is a very old coloring book. It still has the 39 cent um, stamp on it, and I'm gonna start it at $2. It's Alice in Wonderland. It's never been used, and I don't think I have a date. Oh, there's a little bit of damage right here, so you are aware. And... I just do not have a date, guys. That's the only thing I cannot tell you. Unless it's hidden in here really well. But this is what the front cover looks like. So I'm going to say vintage coloring book. It is Alice in Wonderland. It has never been used. It's back when the color books used to be 39 cents. All right, if there's no interest, guys, we can start it at a dollar. Frugalicity comes in at two. Carla okay. came in at one, so you'd have to come in at three, Carla, if you're interested. Yep, there is no barcode, guys. Yep, you are right, loves. Yep. Correct. All right. Go ahead and call this to frugalicity for two. Unless somebody else wants to come in at three. Might be 70s or 80s, they said. Okay. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We are sold to Frugalicity for two dollars. Congratulations. Thank you very much. All right, guys. Here, lose it. Okay. All right. So this is a. Uh, Avon print from 1977. We're going to start it at a two dollars oops let's see my hands right here guys it has a winter scene on there 
It was awarded exclusively to Avon representatives in 1977. Um, I do not know that mom. It just says Avon on it. All right, let's start it at a dollar. Frugalicity comes in at a dollar. Okay. <laughs> You're funny, Mom. Going All twice. right. Going twice. Last call. In five, four, three, two, one. We are sold. Frugalicity for one dollar congratulations cool. all right jeff you ready yep start one dollar the people's pharmacy for older adults the all-new comprehensive guide that answers your questions about drugs aging and improving the quality of your life 85 percent of older americans take at least one drug every single day do you know what they are doing to your body and your future here are the facts For 50 plus, it says. <laughs> 88. Carlos says pass. All right, we'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. Let's try these. Choice starting at $2. These are the cat's meow or the cat's mew. They are signed and dated on the bottoms. They are wood sculptures. A lot of people put them around like in their kitchens on the, like on the, if they have one of those upper shelves, um, there's the farmhouse. In their and wood, they're, correct? Yes, they're made out of wood. Um, something that's kind of interesting about this series is they hide a cat in every single picture. So this one is 1990, signed Phelan, the Admiral Lighthouse. I've got the Red Cross, signed 1991 by Phelan, and the cat is hidden on the back of that one. This one does have a little bit of staining to it. I can try and get, yeah, you can see it there in the corner. I didn't try and clean it off because I don't know how to get it off. So I didn't want to damage it. This one is 1989. 
the Van Berg house. Cats up front on that one. I've got 1989, the Pruin house. Cats in the window. And then I've got 1989, the Bennington Hall House. Cats at the back, uh, I guess the front door. And then I have a garden scene with the cat in the corner. <laughs> Julie comes in at two. They are very cute, yes. And that one actually says American Red Cross on it. can go ahead and start calling it. Going once. Oh, there you go. Sorry, I had me muted. Don't ask me why. That's okay. Going once. Yep. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Julie in 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, one, and we are sold, Julie. And which one or ones did you want? If you take them all, I'll throw this one in free. Vanberg House. Okay. So that is this one here. Correct. All right. Anyone have any other interest in them? Okay. That's yours. I've got 1991 Stoneware Taiwan Home Collection Creamer Green. Started at $2.
Be right back, Jeff. Sorry. Okay. No problem. I have to get some more stuff. Any interest? If not, go ahead and throw down the pass, guys. Carla says pass. All right, we're passing it. All right. You want to show another thing, Jeff, since you had a pass? Sure. Okay. A miniature teapot. It does not have a hole. The lid does not come off. It started at a dollar. It looks like it would be a salt and pepper thing with the hole in the bottom, but it does not have any holes up top that the stuff would come out, so... No markings on the bottom. You're right, Carla. The more we pass, the earlier we pass, the more you get to see. Yep. Any interest, guys? All right. All right. We'll go ahead and pass it. All righty. All right. Do you want me to go up, Jeff? Or yeah. do you want to do another? No, go ahead. I need okay. to go to the bathroom, so I'll be right back. Okay. No problem. Yep. All right, this is a men's sweater jacket. It says it's a size 12 in the thing. I'm going to start this a little higher just because it is very warm and very heavy. And it is black. And I can do measurements. It says it's a size 12 on the tag, guys. So I don't know if it's a military jacket or not. It doesn't look military to me, but it says corporal. It says US number 12, whatever that means. It's the only thing that I see for size. It is fleece lined in the, in the, um, in the jacket. And it is got some weight to it. And I'm gonna start it at $5. Which is a really good deal. It does have a pattern in the front and on the sleeves. And it is black, guys. All right, guys, we're looking for a five dollar bid or pass.
All right, guys, we're going to pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are going to pass it, guys. No problem. I'll throw it on eBay. All right, this is a Banana Republic size 8. And we're going to start this at numbers. And it is a, a um, short little skirt. And it is black in color, not blue. And it does have some stars on it. And it does have some um, kind of like ruffling here in the front. And we're looking for a $2 bid or a pack. All right, guys, we're going to pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and it's passed. All right, let's try this. This is Holiday Lodge size medium. Did I bring it? I probably already brought this up, but we're going to bring it again. Okay, Holiday large size medium sweater start is going to be two dollars it is a warm long sleeve sweater it is fuzzy like fleece it does have the fleece on there perfect for fall Thank you, Carla. It's just the clothing in the hallway, guys. <laughs> I don't know what's in there. Uh, just trying to get through it so we can get the garage stuff in here. Hi, Eric. Um, I will ask Eric. Oh, let me ask Jeff when he comes back here. Um, I'm he may or may not. If he doesn't, I will have to look in my garage for some. But we can see what we can do. Did you see that message, Jeff? I just saw it now. I will check. I'm in like an extra large tall and a large tall. So I'll see what I have that I'm willing to get rid of. I can go look when it's your turn, too. I have um, a bucket out here of men's clothes. It was, I got to get through. No sleeves with pockets. Okay, hold on. Let me make a, a, sh, uh, a cheat sheet, guys. Hi, Kimmers. Okay, we're, we're making... Let me... Okay, and then Carla is looking for medium, large tees, no sleeve. I don't know if I have those with pockets. All right, and Panda wants Okay. Okay. 
I know Panda wanted something too, guys. 2XL pocket tees. I don't think I have any 2XLs. That would be more Jeff's. <laughs> but I will write it down. Okay, I have it all written down. Jeff, if you need it. Okay. All right, we'll pass it. Pass on that one. Grab one more. I've got three or four passes, so I'm okay with it. Short sleeve too. Okay. Um, this is Huntington Valley. It is a men's sweater. I just don't know the size. Uh, it's casuals. It is white and blue. All right, I'm going to have to measure. What's your start? Um, let's go two dollars. I'm gonna guess it's an extra large. It looks like. Okay, let's see. But I don't know. I don't have it completely. It's 22 inches, so yeah, it's an extra large. I do not see any stains or holes, guys. Julie comes in it too. Okay. You just never know what I have in my buckets out here, guys. <laughs> this was at the bottom. It is a rugby style shirt, yes. Yes, you are correct. All right, do you want to call it to Julie for two? All right. We are sold to Julie for two dollars. All righty, thank you, Julie. All right, Jeff, you ready? Yes. Set of two starting at two dollars. They are marked glass bake two eighty six. I think they're called a custard cup. Uh, yes. They do have an etching on them. Let me see if I can get the first cup. Yeah, there we go. How wide across the top? Across the top is three and a half inches. Across the bottom is two inches. Two inches high approximately. Can't do a buck for both of them, sorry.
All right. We will go ahead and pass them. Okay. All right, this is new in box. Malden International Designs 4x6 picture frame. And what is your start, um, Jeff? Three dollars. Okay. Four by six stands vertically or horizontally. It feels like it's metal. Back has that velvet. All right, guys, we're looking for a $3 bid or pass. All right, we'll go ahead and pass it. Okay. Jeff, go ahead and show another thing. Set of two. Spoons. This one says patent 1880. Gorham Boston Athletic Association. And this one says Greenland EPNS on the back. Start on three dollars. Okay. Measure about the one is four inches and the other one is five inches. Yep, you're right. Yep, we will. The Greenland one says on the back also made in Holland. And there's a little symbol back there that I cannot make out. It's like a B with something around it. Uh, the one is spelled G-O-R-H-A-M. And... 
in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're going to go ahead and pass that. All right, start at a dollar. Treasury of Modern Best Sellers, dated 1944 in Chicago. A Treasury of Modern Best Sellers. There is some, what do they call that, foxing, and there's the spine is does have a couple holes in it. Overall, the pages inside are a little discolored, but they look decent. A Treasury of Modern Best Sellers. Let me see what it says in here. It has an introduction. It has the human comedy, One World, King's Row, 30 Seconds Over Tokyo, Junior Miss, Dragon's Teeth, God is My Co-Pilot, Centennial Summer, Between the Thunder and the Sun, Mr. and Mrs. Kuga. It is very interesting. Misha says she's in for a dollar. Sounds good. Nineteen forty four. And it originally sold for forty cents. Go ahead and sell it. All righty. So we're going once to Michelle. Yep. And we are going twice. And last call. And we're going to be sold to Misha in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. Do you want to do another one, Jeff? Sure. Okay. Started a dollar. This is the public speaker's treasure chest. Dated. Nineteen forty two. This book has been written for two groups of persons, men, by the many men and women who must address, introduce a speaker, or preside at a meeting, or a large number of persons who would like to improve their conversational skills. There's a bookmarker in here. Let's see what that says. Oh, there's jokes and jests for your speeches. to avoid, illustrations to use, how to prepare your speech. Misha's in at one. Okay.
All right, do you want me to call it to Misha for one? That works for me. All right, so we're going once. And we are going twice. Last call. And we're going to be sold to Misha in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we are sold, sold, sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. All right. I need to grab something, don't I? All right. I'll put my stuff up, Jeff. Yep. All right. Grab this. It's still on the hanger, guys. You see how this works? All right. This is a dress. And I'm trying to figure what it is. Oh, this is a good one. All right. We got to start this at five. This is Fedricks of Hollywood. And it is a size 11, which is a junior's. It is a um, sleeveless um, dress, and I would say it's a mini skirt kind of a dress. It does go down to my knees, but I'm sure. And, and it is black. It is not blue. And it has this pretty kind of lace pattern throughout the whole dress. And then the back is opened, I would say, about halfway down. And get the whole right. Great for a cocktail party. We're going out on the night in town. And if there's no interest, guys, just type pass. It's not a problem. I will throw it on eBay. All right, guys, we're going to pass it in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four, three, two, one, and we are past. Okay, I have no idea what is in these boxes, guys, sorry. All right, let's grab this. And we'll, I know I brought this back once before, but. All right, this is a coffee mug. We we'll started at a dollar. It is marked on the bottom, uh, banned books. So all of these are banned books that have been banned from the libraries and things of that nature. I would have put it on, on eBay, but I broke the other one, so. like it's never been used. It's marked 2013 on the bottom. Julie's in at a dollar. Okay. All right, do you want to call it to Julie for one? Sure. Okay. Going once. Going twice. Last call in five, four, three, two, one. We are, oh, Fern Darling is in at two. Okay.
All right, so Julie, we're looking for a $3 bid. Julie is out. So we're gonna go ahead and call it to Fern. All right. Go. Fern says she's out now. Okay. Hold on. Now we gotta figure this out, don't we, Jeff? We do. All right. So Fern, we have you at a high bid of two. Um, let me look. Hold on one second. Because sometimes I see the ones that they retracted it, I don't see it. Okay, it's not retracted. Now she says go ahead. So you want it, Fern? Yeah, that's fine. She says okay. All right, we are sold to Fern Darling for $2. All right. How much longer do you want to go, Jeff? Let's do uh, one more round each. Okay. Is that okay with you? Yeah, works for me. All right. I showed this the other day, guys. I'm just going to start at a dollar. I need to clean everything out of my garage. I'm on a, a mission by January to get down to one garage. So I don't have time to list. This is a candle. It's by Lifelines. We're going to start at a dollar, guys. Try this again. And if it doesn't sell this time, I'll just send it to my auction house. Is it scented? No, I don't think it is. It doesn't have a scent to it, Jeff. Okay. Those are the cool ones that as they burn down, it looks like stained glass shining through it. Oh, does it really? Yeah. Vexing Rose comes in at a dollar. Thank you, guys. All right, let's call it to Vexing Rose for a dollar. Going once, going twice, last call. In five, four, three, two, one, we are sold to Vexing Rose for a dollar. Congratulations. Thank you very much. All right, Jeff, you ready? I am. All righty. Tupperware. <laughs> I think this oops, is the marinade, the small marinade, April, you were telling me? Yes. Started at $2. And I can't spell it, so. lid fits nice and snug doesn't look like it was ever used the orange color All right, guys, we're looking for a $2 bid on this Tupperware container. It's a small marinator one. I'll give you dimensions. Six and a half by 10. 
could fit a nice steak in there. We must not have the Tupperware people in here. It's okay. 1292-5 is the number on the bottom of it. Made in the USA. Yep. See that as often as you used to. Let's go ahead and pass it. Alrighty. Throw it on eBay. Christmas tea light candle holder. You put your tea light in there and it lights up. It shows the moon and the stars. Start it at $2. Okay. All right, guys, we're looking for a $2 bid or pass. No markings on the bottom. You can see how it illuminates at night. That's just with a flashlight. That's pretty cool. Yeah. And it actually casts out the shape of like the stars and the moon on the wall though. All right, guys, we're looking for a $2 start on this Christmas tree holder. Otherwise, we're going to go ahead and pass it. Any interest or throw a pass, guys. So we know what to do here. In five, four, three, two, one. We're going to go ahead and pass it. All right, set of two books. Trevor's Place, the story of the boy who brings hope to the homeless and cosmic conflict. Good and evil wage war for the planet Earth. Start them at a dollar. Okay. For the pair. Okay.
think everyone fell asleep. I know. That's what I was thinking too. Just go ahead and start. Keep showing, Jeff. I'll just skip my turn. I'm good with it. All right. Uh, one of these flask water bottle things. It says on it, um, Radiator Incorporated, Railroad Street. Brand new. Never had any liquid in it. It is BPA free. Stainless steel 100%. Do not microwave. Hand washing recommended. 740 milliliters. 25 ounces. Started at a dollar. Okay. All right, guys, we're looking for a $1 bid or pass. went to sleep, Jeff. I think so. <laughs> do you want to just call it then? Or what do you want to do? Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Let's put us both up and do a drawing. It's the brand it Hydro Flask. I don't know. It says hit. BPA free. Vexing Rose says pass. Yeah. We'll go ahead and pass it. That's okay. Okay. What do you want to do, Jeff? Let's call it. Okay. All right. Do you want to draw a drawing or no drawing? Yeah, we can do one. Okay. Why am I so big over here? What the heck? There. All right. Um, let's do one through 15 because we only have 12 people in here. Sounds good. Okay. Uh, I've got to see if I can figure out how to get this. If you can't, then just privately send it to me if you can. Okay. And then I'll send you mine that way. I got it. Okay. Let's go. Let's go this way. All right. You see mine? Yes. Okay. I already got it ready. So one through 15, guys. Oh, you already got it in. Pick only one number. We're starting yep. with April's. Okay. Sounds good to me. Mm. 
All right, pick again. Yep. Pages one. Okay. All right. All right, so the winner was Pages. Just watch your invoice page. You know I do funky things on it. <laughs> um, okay, pick one number. Oops. From one through 15. And now we're going to do Jeff's number. Start. Pages got it. Okay. Pages on a winner kick today. Yeah. All right. So the winner was Pages. I don't know if it showed up, so I'm going to do it again. Yeah, Pages, you won both. <laughs> we'll see what, what Jeff's going to do. Yeah, we'll just, it'll be a mystery, but I'll come okay. up with something. All right. Because I don't think Paige is ordered for me yet. So, but we'll okay. figure out something. Yeah. Not a problem. All right. So, we're going to do a little bit of housekeeping here. Um, Jeff has a Buy It Now special on my channel. A, we have a boys lock of 10 through 14, very good name brands. It's $25 plus um, plus the shipping. And it's exact. It's probably eight, nine bucks for the shipping. So um, if anybody's interested in that, please just write sold on that comment. And then Jeff will go ahead and handle it. Um, we will be doing more buy it now between Jeff and I. And we're going to start downloading more buy it now. So kind of keep an eye out for that. Um, the next one I'm doing is probably going to be children's books. I've got a ton of children's books, so I'm going to do a buy it now. So just keep an eye out on my channel, guys, because anything that Jeff does for buy it now, it will be on my channel. And then our next auction, um, Jeff and I will be on Friday, um, same time. And then we'll see what we're going to do next week. So it just we play it by ear. So if we'll go on Sunday, or if we'll go on Monday, so that's kind of what we've been doing. So, right, we appreciate everybody being here and buying from us tonight. Um, I am still behind on shipping. Um, trying to get caught up today was not a very good day. I did not get much done. I apologize. Um, I'm going to hope to try to do it tomorrow. So, in the afternoon. So, we're going to say goodbye to everybody. Yep, we'll see everybody. And I'm probably going to wait till Friday to start invoicing and shipping, if that's okay with everyone, unless someone needs their stuff shipped out immediately. But I'll wait till Friday. That way, if you buy more from me, you get the best deal on shipping. Yep. Anything else, Jeff? I think that's it. Okay. Bye, loves. Bye, everybody. Thank you for coming. We'll yep. see you on Friday. Yep.